Hi guys, welcome to Spooky Codes. Today I'm going to show you how you can install Google Apps on the Amazon Fire TV stick. So, uh, just an Amazon Fire TV. So, uh, we only have YouTube on the Amazon Fire TV stick that's provided by Google just right now. So, uh, we don't get some apps like Google Play Movies and the, uh, yeah, you know, so, and the Play Store. So, uh, we, we're just going to bring them back into this. So it's basically Android, or will be, uh, we all know that. So it just supports APK files. So um, I've provided in the description below uh, a zip file. It contains six APK files. So um, let's jump on to that. And uh, before we begin, I would like to show you my channel. And uh, if you find it interesting, please subscribe to my channel and also like this video. And if you have any problems on any software or any anything, you can just comment it below. On below. Yeah. Okay, so uh, let us begin about this. First, we need to download the six files that is on the description below. So, after downloading those six files, it's actually in a zip. So, it's a zip file. So you have to download it from the description below. And uh, yeah, you need to download this app, which is called Apps to Fire. So, I'm just going to install it and just show you how its basic steps for um, setup are. So, um, let us wait for its install. Yeah pretty fast still yeah it's installing so uh, let us go ahead and open that yeah so now we can see that logo so after that we'll just be uh, shown some terms and conditions so um, I'm just going to agree with that so cl just clicking on I agree so uh, on that app now what we have to do is we need to slide to the setup tab and and type in our ip address so if you don't know the ip address you may can find it in the network connection settings in the amazon fire tv stick or else you may have to go to the router settings okay So just let me go to the router settings. So here it is. So in the LAN info, I can see the IP address of my Fire TV stick. So um, you can also do it by going into the connection settings of the Fire TV stick. And uh, we need the IP address of the device to which the Wi-Fi is connected on. So from here, next you will need to go to settings and then to my Fire TV and then to developer options okay from here and enable these two so enable that one and enable this one and click on turn on okay that's okay and right now we're just going to this so um, what I'm just going to do is I'm just going to flash some apps on the fire TV stick so we are using the exact app itself so here we are right there so from here okay so let just me just let me browse that so um it's not there so okay we finally found it so i'm just going to click on cancel and uh okay where did it go right now let me look yeah these are the files i'm just going to install it so if you sometimes see the installation failed, you may have to uh, rename the file and flash it again. So it depends on devices that you are using. So I'm just going to fast forward this video until this finishes. So um, it's not uh, necessary for all the six apps to install, but I recommend you install the six apps. So out of which three are very much important for the working of the Google Play services. So. Um, I think that the current version of Google Play services that we have, uh, I mean the Google Play Store that we have right installed uh, on this may not be working right now. So um, yeah, that would happen. So I'm just going to close that on the fire stick. So it's just going to finish. There's some more files left for me to flash onto this. And yes, we have right now installed this much file. So I think it's one more left. So okay, we are here now, 
okay these are my apps so yeah we have finished installing all the six apps so yes we need to restart our device so then we have to do something like this and to go into the apps and then we need to open the play store and now we would be asked to sign in so let me just enter my email id and password so it may be showing up any second now okay enter the email so i'm just going to fast forward this because it just takes too much time so guys it's signing in right now so from here we will see okay just taking is too much time to sign in yeah and uh, we have reached here it is called backup and restore so i'll just next it so you know that's a bad process on the amazon 5 tv stick second gen which is what i have and uh, it's too much slow so um, unfortunately the play store in the amazon 5 tv stick that we just installed right now is not working but in the later future i will post a video about figuring it figuring this out and also installing the play store so as you can see nothing is working here on the play store <coughs> but the only problem is for the play store and uh, now let us go and open the app that we want and that we have in the title of this video so uh, where is it okay it's an apps so uh, let's go ahead oh no bad processor next time i should might consider buying a good one okay that's a google play movies so um it must load right now yeah here it is and um, it's full of white right okay here we are now so uh, come on load it yes all the movies that we should have watched and we have that we can have uh, watched right now is right over here so uh, you may have to pay for that but have paid for one of the Malayalam movies okay it's just basically where I'm from this one of that movie and uh, unfortunately and uh, for a good purpose Google Play movies doesn't uh, allow capturing from here so uh, trust me it is playing right now and uh, you may see the subtitles yeah it's right over there trust me it is playing and it does show up in the screen on my TV but it doesn't allow recording so uh, that's it guys thanks for watching and uh, please do post in the comments below if you have any issues on any of the software on your device so uh, thank you guys for watching and uh, subscribe to my channel and give the thumbs up if you like this video bye